All right, guys. Uh, my apologies. It's gonna be an unboxing uh, review here on the uh, Canon PowerShot SX60HS camera. Uh, this is kind of like something improvised right here. So uh, we're gonna take a look at the camera uh, later. But first, I want to show you what's uh, included in the box. Obviously, you get all the uh, instructions, the manuals, the warranty, and all that. And here is the uh, charger uh, to charge the battery of the camera. It has some uh, nice uh, LED indicator right here. And there is a plug. All right, so now let's uh, take a look here at the camera. So as you guys can see, a really nice uh, looking camera here, kind of like a rubberized uh, finish. Uh, the handle or the grip right here is actually a really, really good size. So as you guys can see, it's really easy to hold with one hand. We have a 3-inch uh, LCD screen. The uh, resolution is, I believe, it's at 921,000 dots. So it's supposed to be pretty good. It is actually really good. Let's go ahead and turn it on for a quick moment here. Take a look at that soup right there. One of the main features of this camera is the uh, powerful zoom. Uh, we're looking at a 65x optical zoom, so you can go really, really far. Let me see if I can show you there. So you can go really, really far, and the video is gonna be clear. Also pictures. Now, as you guys can see, as I'm moving the camera, it's showing the out of focus. That's one of the things that I really, really like about this camera. The autofocus on this camera, it's absolutely amazing. I have never been in a situation where the uh, camera is not focusing so far. Uh, right here on the top, we get access to mount an additional flash or uh, external microphone. Uh, right here, there is a port uh, to connect an external microphone for better audio. Uh, also, as you guys can see, it comes with an electronic viewfinder. And I'm going to go over some of the controls. I don't want to get too technical into all of these because some of the controls I don't even know how to use yet. Uh, as you guys can see, I mounted right here this uh, tulip hood or flower hood or lens hood, whatever you want to call it. Uh, let me go ahead and turn this on, so turn it off so I can show you guys... Uh, so basically this is something that you can mount right there. And speaking about this, because of this uh, shape right here, uh, you're gonna be able to mount uh, filters. Uh, you can get a wide angle lens, feature lens, and things like that. I'm gonna try to include uh, in the description of this uh, video, a couple of links uh, of those uh, accessories that I found on uh, Amazon or eBay. But I got this, uh, hood for right now for the lens take a look at the lens right there it's a 55 millimeter lens now right here on the top let's go ahead and turn it on again and there is a look at the flash you have you actually have to manually open the flash right there it doesn't come up automatically so right here on the top we have uh, all these uh, dials and as you guys can see you can control multiple till here uh, right now I have it in the auto mode, uh, there is that one, there is a P which is a program I believe, uh, TV, AV, manual, there are multiple different settings, and here's a look at the uh, play button, if you uh, click right there, that's going to take you to the last uh, picture taken, and with the uh, zoom button right here, uh, you can actually resize uh, the uh, how the pictures looks like on the uh, LCD screen. So as you can see, the screen looks uh, really clear. So we go back here to the uh, to the screen. Uh, we have right here different options. Uh, we have the macro option for the focus, so you can get really really close to objects. And if we click right here in the middle, we, we have some uh, different, different settings here. 
I'm not gonna go through everything, but just to show you guys uh, some of them. So uh, let's see here, we have the menu here. So these are some of the uh, options that we have. And there's the option for the menu. Uh, you can adjust uh, right there the uh, zoom, the autofocus, the flash. Uh, you get blink detection, custom display. So these are some of the settings that this camera offers. Uh, if we go back here to the top and go next, you get access to control the volume. So as you are clicking on these uh, buttons right here, there is a beep. So you can turn up or down the volume for that. You can adjust the date, the time zone, the lens uh, retraction. There is a power saving mode. There is a LCD brightness which uh, we can adjust and take a look at that this thing can get really really bright let's go back to the top now and the next one right here it's uh, basically something that you can create called my menu so you can add right there your favorite uh, settings. So if we click menu again, we're back here to the uh, camera mode. Another cool thing of the camera, guys, is the fact that you can flip uh, the screen out. So that's a really, really convenient option. Now, uh, just so you know, the uh, LCD, it's not touch screen. And you can just use the viewfinder if you don't want to use the uh, LCD. So in order to start video, we play uh, press right here. And that's when I start a video. Take a look at how far the uh, zoom extends. It goes uh, really, really far. And let's uh, stop the video here. Uh, taking pictures, uh, we press uh, right here. takes the pictures are uh, really quick uh, we also have right here on this side other ports I believe these are uh, USB port HDMI port and this is how the uh, camera looks like uh, from the bottom we have access right here to the uh, battery as well as to the micro SD card and here's the access to mount uh, the camera on a tripod. Uh, price on the camera, guys, uh, it's uh, about $580, $579. Uh, but I believe it's available on sale right now for $449. Uh, really, really good camera. Uh, when it comes to the recording, the video resolution, it gets up to 1080p at 60 frames per second. A uh, super clear video. Again, the main feature on this camera is the uh, super powerful 65S X uh, zoom. I'm sorry. Uh, so why don't we go ahead and take a look at some uh, picture samples as well as uh, some video recording and also doing some videos and pictures uh, using the uh, 65X amazing zoom.
guys, so there you have it. I wanna thank you for watching this video. I it was the Canon Power Shot SX60. Really, really nice uh, point of shoot mirrorless uh, camera available for about $449. So thank you, I will see you later.